All right, guys. So today we're working on this Kia. Angel's here, guys. He's alive and well. Car's gone, but he's alive. That's all that matters. But we're doing a clutch in it, guys. And we're just gonna go ahead and pull the wheels off of it, and then I'll get on the dirt, start pulling axles out of it, and shit like that. While he's tearing apart the top of it, so we can unbolt and get this pulled out. So should be good. Get it out, and then. I got a new, we got the new clutch, flywheel, pressure plate, and slave for it over there. And then go ahead and get it all put back together. And, you know, might do like a tutorial on how to do it. You know, see how it goes. But for now, pull the wheels off. There are 21s. And then all the axles and stuff like that. Alright, guys, so a little bit of an update. All this up here is pretty much taken apart. Slave is out. All the harness is out. All we got left is the linkages, which is one right here, and the other one's right there. Take those off, and then we can unbolt it. And then you got this front mount that's got to come off. Starter. Got this axle out. We got to get the starter. And then Angel's taking apart this side right now. been over beating on this for a while trying to get the axle out of the spindle but it don't want to come out so I just took it out of the transmission so then I'm gonna probably take this bolt off and take the whole assembly off take the caliper off and just take the assembly off the car be easier probably if need be if I can get the transmission down without having to take it apart then awesome so he's gonna go ahead and finish that side and then we'll start on bolting it mm. Quick break, y'all. Good. But, got a lot more done. Linkages off. Absolutely are out. The bottom bolts are out. Just gotta get a starter. And, pull this plastic shit off. All this plastic in here. Put boots on top, and then a mount, and the training oh, no. should come out. All right, guys. Um, starters out. All that shit's done. There's a couple more bolts on the top, then the mounts, and it should be able to come right out. So, sorry we're not recording a lot. Just trying to get this done. Customer really would like to try and get the car back today, and it's already like four o'clock. So, yeah. If not, tomorrow's another day. But we're gonna keep on pushing. Like I said, just a couple more mount or bolts on the top, and then this mount, this mount, and then there's a mount on the back, and then it should come right out. All right, guys. So front mounts off, rear mounts off. Getting less, like three or four training bolts on the top. Jack's holding the motor up, and then we got that one mount over there, and hopefully the training comes out. So we got to pull the mount and the bracket completely off, so we can try and go underneath the frame and subframe. Like the body of the car in the subframe, but back enough and they can tilt the front down. So, that's what they say. We'll see. So, yep. And like that, transmission's out. So, that should be more than enough out of my way. Or I can get all the bolts off the flywheel or pressure plate and then take the clutch out and everything. And the torque, or the pressure plate, flywheel, and the clutch disc. Yep, I'm gonna go ahead and get that removed and then start buttoning it back up. Alright, so here's the clutch disc and here's the flywheel, or the pressure plate, I mean. So we've got some heat spots all around in it, as you can see. The clutch disc is pretty much worn. In. So, yep, I'm gonna go ahead and replace all that. And turn on this light over here. See, but got a couple heat spots on there. So, we to talk to the customer, waiting to hear back from them, to see if we're gonna pick up a new one, because it's like twelve dollars more to get a new one. Pretty much the same situation with the Accord when we replaced it. So, when I hear back from them, I'll know more, and we'll see what happens. Yeah, boy. 
Uh, Alright guys, so I talked to the customer and everything. Um, we're going to order a new flywheel for it. It'll be here in the morning. So for tonight, I guess that will be it. So I guess we'll clean up the garage and call it a day. But until then, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Alright guys, so we're back at it the next day. And we got the flywheel. So we can get that installed and get all the new clutch stuff, which is over here. I'll put on, I'll torque down the specs, and then go ahead and slap the training back on and start assembly. Angel's on his way here, so hopefully we get this done here soon, huh? But I'm just going to jump okay, right so in, you guys. We got the transmission up, <clears throat> this mount on. Um, just in case you all don't know, there's two bolts right here. They got little covers you pop off, and you can pull this mount out. So there's those two bolts, these. There's this, and then there's this bolt here, this bolt here, and then a bolt underneath the mount as well for that motor mount. Which is our training mount. It's a little bit tricky, but that's how that one comes out. Then the front mount and the back mount needs to come off. You can leave the motor mount over there on. So, yeah, we're almost, well, not almost done, but we're there. <laughs> There's a couple more things to do. Um, all the clutch stuff's on and torque down the specs. So, I'm just going to go ahead and finish up. I mean, not much left. And then we got to replace the slave cylinder, too. Alright guys, so I don't know if I told up. you guys yet, but that master was actually bad as well. The rod was bent, so it wasn't giving a good pedal. So we went ahead and got a new one, and I just installed it. Right there, it's got two um, 12 millimeters, and then the line pipe wrench you're going to have to put on the hard line, and then this here because it, it feeds through the brake master. So we're going to go ahead and pump it, and then you bleed it right here. So that she's gonna have a pedal and she'll be ready to rip all right guys so we're in the hyundai you're gonna take it around the block and she's moving on her own power seems to be doing good customers at the house already she just wanted me to touch drive the car first but she seems to be doing great it's awesome Go back to the house and hand off her car to her and we have yet another happy customer hopefully hopefully another customer for returning work so see you guys on the next project hi guys so the key is gone done so that's the end of this video please like comment subscribe stay tuned things are going down on the accord so stay tuned for that video not sure how soon the video for the accord will be coming out that sounds really bright sorry if i'm uh, squinting but not sure how soon the video will be coming out for that because I'm still waiting on a couple parts coming for it. But things are about to happen for it. So, yeah, like I said, guys, like, comment, subscribe, share, please. And we'll catch you guys in the next one.